hey, I've been thinking about you and true to myself, endlessly am behind on everything I want to do. So I'm going to make this sweet little video for you to remind you that you are incredible and you're doing your best and people see that and we are proud of you. So with that, I had a friend that I was talking to the other day and they apologize a lot when they finish any sentence. Any sentence that they say ends with an I'm sorry as if like I'm sorry for existing. This is not something to accredit to myself. There's a comic and I will try to find it and link it here but it's talking about how important it is to say thank you instead of saying I'm sorry all the time. And of course I'm not saying let's eradicate apologies because there are times that we do need to apologize but there's also a lot of times that we don't need to and this is something we see very commonly with women and it's definitely something we see among men as well as well as just humanity just people you might be an over apologizer and that's fine but let's just take it one step further in this comic and this is something that sat with me for years it's saying to say thank you instead of saying i'm sorry so instead of saying I'm sorry for telling you that story, saying thank you for listening to my feelings. Instead of saying sorry that I'm late, saying thank you for waiting for me. That is again, depending on the situation, probably still good to apologize if you're running late for something that's important. But I definitely like to include the thank you. One of the reasons why this is an important thing to me and something that's helped me is one, apologizing all the time is exhausting and you do start like taking on a lot more than you need to. Like a lot of guilt, whatever. Who cares? Let's get rid of that. No one needs that. Well, some people do need it, but realistically, if you're apologizing for speaking, then you don't need it. The other thing is, ooh, that's a nice little ray of sunshine. Um, <laughs> here? Here. Ooh, that sun is getting strong. You know what? I'm just gonna come over here. Ooh, that is bright. Um, the other thing that's nice about saying thank you instead of saying I'm sorry when, again, let's just say with like speaking, is then the person doesn't have to like reassure you they get to like say you're welcome and they get to be a part of this this is too bright i can't handle this what if i do this put my window oh my gosh it is so bright i'm just going over to the dark side okay so what was i saying i don't know you just feel more included and like it's like a more positive interaction for everyone so i know that ever since i have seen that and started doing that and my sweet boyfriend riley makes fun of me all the time because i'll say like if I, you know, I'm walking in front of someone or whatever, like the grocery store or wherever, um, I'll be like, sorry, thank you, um, as I pass by. And he's like, why did you, you know, why do you say both of them? But it's like, I am sorry for being in your way. And also I'm grateful that like you made room for me um, because people don't have to, you know, people by all means can be horrible. But my boyfriend also doesn't really understand the fact that like sometimes like pedestrians do have the right of way, but also they have a car. Like, if they just are having a bad day or just have, like, a lapse for a moment, like, they're the ones who could kill us. We don't have power in that. We're not going to win that fight, you know? What an idiot. I hope that that's something that can help you, and I hope that uh, this week you try to just say thank you more instead of saying I'm sorry. And again, and I'm sure you already know, there are times that we do need to apologize, but I think if, especially if you're the kind of person that watches these videos, you probably are an over-apologizer. And just try saying thank you and see how that goes and see how that works for yourself. 